this is not a lot of space. This, this is how much space I'm working with. I was looking high and low for a desk that would fit this space perfectly and still allow for me to have enough space to actually like get stuff done because eventually I want to I want a desktop computer just for editing but this is insane like <laughs> this is not a lot of space like hopefully this fits I'm kind of worried because I think it might be a little bit bigger I had to get something around 32 inches wide we will see if it fits this is the amount of space I'm working with up close. I wanted a standing desk. That is why the search took me literally forever. And I wanted it to be electric, but for the amount of space that I'm working with, they only had a manual one. So I was like, I'm just gonna have to work with this. I don't feel like doing this. I'm not the biggest fan of piecing stuff together. As expected, has a decent amount of pieces. But the instructions look pretty decent. So, hopefully I'll knock it out in like an hour. This right here, this right here is the first step. Y'all know it did not take me no one hour. I wasn't even thinking about the fact that I'm filming this and getting all these shots. So, absolutely not. But the instructions were clear. I just needed to pay a little bit more attention because I was over here trying to use a drill. You don't need a drill because the tool that you need is already in there. And then the numbers and the letters are correlated to the images, so it works really well. And I just had to slow down. So far, so good. Even though that was just the first step. Everything being labeled with a number or even a letter, that's really helping a lot. And the instructions are very clear. A lot of the reviews that were bad were complaining about the ability to roll it. And I agree. The rolling is not smooth, but it's still it's still possible. This is cracking me up. It literally just barely fits. I don't plan on moving this. It's gonna stay in this one spot because it's supposed to be able to basically move to like if you wanna work from your bed. I don't plan on working from my bed. That was the whole reason I got this. So I will not be moving this. It's staying in one spot. And so I'm not really worried about the rolling aspect but I was worried about the ability to turn it into a standing desk because I want that to be super easy and straightforward. But I was like, I don't know, is it gonna work? I'm still not done yet. I just have to put in the sliding compartment. It took me about two hours and it actually works. It's a little bit rusty, but if you unscrew it enough, you definitely can do it, but I was really hesitant at first, but it worked out perfectly and I was done. And I actually liked the way it looked. I was worried it was gonna look a little cheapish, but it works for this. And I believe when I finally get all my accessories, it'll start looking a lot better. Probably gonna get me a little laptop stand and work up, save up some money for a desktop computer because I'm trying to really, really get in my editing bag. So I'm gonna need an upgrade, but I really like the way it looks. It's super cute, it fit perfectly. I got out my office chair and set it up. I like it. The chair is comfortable as well. It's supposed to be one of those that really supports your back. I love it. I mean, look at me, I'm testing it out right here. Ooh, a little giggle. <laughs> Got my little iced coffee out the next day. I had to put it to work, put it to test, but I love it. Let me know in the comments what you guys think. What would you do differently? Thanks for watching.